Hey man, I'm Chris with Phone Cats, and here is another Grotopia gameplay. Oh, we got Sinestro here. Say hi, man. Hello. All right. Um, this video, if I, I thought last video was a little controversial, but this one is just straight up, <laughs> straight up drama bomb. Um, Sinestro, do you want to talk about some of your history real quick, and maybe some of your other accounts, and that'll be a nice way to get started. Yeah. Uh, I'm Kilo, K I L O L. I I invented many of the scams. Example: Grub Games, Crystal Switch, Clothing Switch, Shotgun Switch. Yeah, many scams. So those are four big ones, or four of the most popular ones. Yeah. Okay, and uh, I from the video yesterday, we know that there was like some shadiness going on. Um, I'm gonna spam out a super broadcast just so that a million people come. Is the door open or no? Uh, it's open. Cool. We'll see what happens if people show up in Growbar. So let's start off with talking about straight up drop games. You were just telling me that initially you you invented drop games, right? Yeah. And talk about how at first it literally was just a game. Yeah, it was just a game. I I, I got. Yeah, I made a new game because I wanted to. I think it was funny, but then uh, then the mods came in. Yeah, mm -hmm. I don't say who. They... Yeah, that's probably for the better. Oh, that's pig. I saw that pig. Don't get distracted. Stick with me, Sinister <laughs> Sinestro. <laughs> um, so yeah. the 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 mod came in, and at that point, were you even scamming people, or was it really just a game that yeah, people would was, play for fun? It was a game when the mod came in. Wow, and they still got mad. Yeah. Because they knew that eventually it would turn into a scam, or what do you think? I don't know. Okay, let's talk about uh, some of the psychology of drop scams. Why do people fall for it? Is it because they're greedy and they see the prize? Yeah, I think so. Or oh, it's because uh, they get friends and uh, the friends can ban them. The friends what? The friends, uh, they can uh, ban uh, the people. The, the, oh yeah, the I gotcha, I gotcha. And that's so the friends can ban them. Whenever you would do drop scams, would you ever have a friend with you and give them and let them win? Yeah. And Definitely. that's something that other people see and then they're like, oh my god, this, is a, this isn't a scam, this is a real one, right? Yeah, but uh, <laughs> the guy. What guy? What are you talking about? Uh, your mods <laughs> in his mind. Uh. Um, okay, so tell me a little bit about the Crystal Seed Scam Switch. How does that one work? Oh, you got like Crystal Seed. And then mm -hmm. you have a Cloud Stone Block Seed or a Pistol Block Seed. Mm -hmm. You change them uh, when, they don't, when they're riding, uh, you go out and say, or you're gonna go out of system trade. And uh, then you say, uh, yeah. Then, then you say, oops, fail, my fingers light. Then you go in again, put your paste or cloud stone. Then uh, you put the fingers, and you're upset, and he's upset. So those seeds look very much alike to the point that when you redo the trade, people don't even notice the difference? Uh, yes, they do now. Crystal seed and uh, paste buttons change a lot. Ooh, so you might be kind of responsible for them having to change the way the seeds look? Yeah. Dang. Um, let's get to the clothing seed one. What's the deal with that? Um, the clothing seed, uh, no, yeah. Um, I bought, um, I bought uh, a clothing seed. Mm -hmm. Um, of someone. It was a white, a white beard seed. It, and those are, are those like, uh, th what's the deal with them? Are they like a glitch seed or they're not real or they're no longer around? You could get them in the, in the first of a uh, Brutopia. And now there's no way to get them. So every clothing seed is like just a super rare? Yeah. I had a okay. clothing seed. I a what seed? I uh, double saver when double saver was uh, uh, 
Yeah, all 100 warlocks. Oof. And uh, you made a little list of four different scams. We talked about drop scams, crystal scam, clothing seed, and your latest, I think, was a shotgun switcheroo, right? Yeah. Tell me about that. Oh, I had this shotgun and uh, mm -hmm. and uh, then a thunder gun. I looked at it and uh, I saw I can scam with this if I do it fast. Dang, and people just don't notice that you switch to a normal gun or no. they just see a gun down there? They, they just see a gun. Yeah. Mm -mm. So those are four popular scams and you're doing this vid with me right now because you're pretty much like coming clean, right? Yeah, I'm trying to. That's cool, man. I, I hope you don't relapse and like if I find you doing another scam thing, it's gonna like break my heart and make me frustrated at the same time. Yeah. So I hope that you're like going legit. If you do, kill me. <laughs> no, not way too violent, but I mean, uh, we were talking about how you saw yesterday's vid, right? That had Provoid in it. Oh, uh, yeah. And you could uh, you could hear in his voice that he was sad about it, right? Yeah. Did that help? Uh, did that help you want to turn over a new leaf at all, or did that help you realize that there's like a real person on the other end of these scams, or no? Yeah, I, I feel yeah. sad when I hear his voice. That's cool, man. I, I appreciate you uh, saying that, and I'm sure Pro Void is gonna, um, I don't know, he'll appreciate that. Oh. Uh, but let's not talk about that too much. But. At the same time, let's talk about friend scams. Do you think that's like a big problem in Grotopia? Friend scams. Like where, it's just like the access scam basically, to where uh, someone just wants a friend so they give you access. Yeah. Is that basically what happened with Provoid? Like y'all didn't know each other very well and he yeah, just gave you access? Oh, he just gave me access. I think because I had access in the Los Angeles. Oh, okay. So he saw that you were kind of trusted there. Yeah. And then he went out on a limb and trusted you in his world. What, you want to know how I met Boy Ninja? How to what? How I met Boy Ninja. Yeah, tell me, because uh, you had access over there too, and that was its own little drama bomb. Yeah, it was because first I tried to scam him. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Then I met him in Los Angeles. He said, hey, you tried to scam me. And I, and I did right. Oh, yeah, yeah. And uh and then we got friends. See, isn't that weird? Yeah. Do you know what? Uh, you know how in real life, when people get into a fight, they'll become good friends afterwards. Is that kind of what happened? Yeah. Like y'all had a little bit of tension in your first contact, and then afterwards y'all were like bros. Yeah. Isn't that funny? Okay. Uh, any other scams that you want to warn people about, or any other uh, tips for people to avoid getting scammed? That, that's a new scam, like Pro has said, the trust test. Yeah, talk about that a little bit. Have you ever, did you ever scan it, scam anyone with trust test or no? Nah, I, I know, I never tried it. I, I've seen it. But mm -hmm. I, I don't remember. This is important. Um, I, yeah, Pro, I, he lost his angel to someone who, who, who switched uh, willows without, without people uh, could see it. I don't know who. But Wait, say that again? Provoid lost his angels because he switched his world lock? Yeah. I'm confused. He took he took his world lock off his world, or what do you mean? No. Um, in the uh, insistent trade, he took world lock without, uh, without Provoid to see it. Oh, I think I got you. Okay, let's talk about your world for a little bit, dude, because, I mean, if 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 me making this vid uh, pulls K-I-L-O-L and Sinestro onto the good side of Grotopia, then this is well worth it. And uh, we were getting chatty before we started recording, and you made this world by yourself, right? This was all your creation? Yeah. Nico? Man, because this is actually pretty cool, dude, with a... Uh, like, you got the little tractor beam coming down from the UFO? Is that, um... Are you using amber glass and normal glass? Yeah. That's cool, because it has like a little bit of a contrast to it. And they're scooping up those cows with a tractor beam. <laughs> yeah. 
pretty dope. And I saw that there was some parkour over here. Yeah, dude. Um, I like it. Like this is a like a, a snazzy little world. I like your airplane pixel heart, and I want you to be on like the good uh, the good side of a Grotopia. Yeah. Um, do you want to talk about any scamming circles or anything like that? Because I've read on the forums that there's scammer rings, or groups of scammers, like scammer clans almost. Is that something that you've ever been affiliated with, or is that... No, I know. Nothing. Because supposedly there's like scamming groups and like little scamming teams, I don't even know what to call them, but they'll just go around looting people with drop games and like keep everything in one world. Yeah. Man, look at these cows. You better milk. Do you milk these cows that are getting pulled up by that tractor beam? <laughs> or it kind of looks funny that they're no, scared. No, my friend, they, t they, t they take all the milk when, they when I'm not here. Ah, people <laughs> got access grief in your milk. <laughs> yeah. Okay, um, earlier you were talking about how there's no trust amongst scammers. Talk about that, how, like, you and another scammer would scam each other back and forth. What did you say? Try again. Oh, you don't need to mention the person's name or anything, but you were saying there was one person that you would scam items back and forth with? Like, he scammed your items and then oh. you scammed them back? Yeah. Uh, we was friends. Uh, I, he had asked him, he, had, he said he wanted to quit. Mm -hmm. He asked me about if he could uh, try to uh, win the angle and learn him before he quit. He mm -hmm. only tried to win the so I, I, I trusted him. I gave, I gave him to him. He, um, yeah, he left. He gave me crimsons and he left with, my, with all my things. He he had double saber, he took, he took my double saber, he took my, my angel wing and all the stuff I had. Oof. Yeah. I was not. I, he created all my world. I built, I built it again. Dang. Um, tell me a little bit about, um, do you think that there's scammer karma? Or do you think that, like, have you been scammed a lot besides that time that you were just talking about? Did you get scammed at first or no? Um, I don't remember. It's a long time ago. But, uh, yeah. I don't think I, so. I feel like a lot of scammers start scamming because they got scammed. And it just creates this, like... And that's just part of the scamming culture of Grotopia. Like, they would lose their angels or a world lock and see that someone got items like that. Yeah. Mm-mm. Any uh, other little tidbits you want to throw out or anything uh, that you want to... Do you want to give any shout-outs to people or even apologize to anyone that you've scammed in the past that you want to be cool with? Yeah, Shy Guy. Shy Guy. And did I just hear a cat in the background? Yeah, that's my cat. Oh, getting bonus points. See? Start <laughs> out as a scammer and now you got a cat meowing in the background and I'm on your side. <laughs> so Shy Boy? Shy Guy. Shy Guy? Yeah. Anyone else? This is your chance to repent some sins. Yeah. D M N Whoosh. I scammed okay. him uh, for not so long time. Oh, 105 play seed I took from him. What was it? 105? Oh, 100 fireplace seeds. Dang, fireplace seeds? 105? Yeah. Yeesh. See, I don't want to talk about too much about the stuff that you scammed because I don't want to contribute to scamming culture. The reason that you're on right now is because you said that you were going to go clean, and I'm hoping that I can trust you on that. And you jotted down all those anti-scam tips, and I think this vid is going to help the community. So thank you for that, and uh, any shout-outs you want to throw out to friends? Yeah, Nicole. Okay, and we were talking about that, um, but we'll uh, we'll keep that off the record. Any last shout-outs? Mm. Not really. I cool, man. Well, that's going to wrap this vid up. Thanks for doing this, and uh, I hope that you join the White Knights of Grotopia. Um, if I see someone spamming for a drop game, doing a super broadcast, I would be so proud if I saw you there yelling drop game or this is a scam. Like, I want you to be on the good team, dude. Yeah. 
Well, thanks for doing this, and that's gonna wrap this video up. Thanks for watching. Phone cats.